We need to get up to the roof. Scarecrow's there. What happened? I went after Crane and got caught. Jim, I'm sorry about Barbara. Don't. Let's just get this over with. I should have stopped him. Jim, look out! Jim, I've been worse. Jim, I just want to say, working with Barbara, it was an honor. Don't. Even if you'd known what she was doing, you couldn't have stopped her. Stubborn like her old man. Brave. You know, you see a lot in this job. A lot of pain. A lot of suffering. But I'll never forget taking a witness statement from an eight-year-old boy who'd just seen his parents gunned down. You were kind, Jim. I was thinking I may never get a chance to tell you this. To say, sorry. You don't need to. We're the same, Bruce. We'd do anything for our family. Come on. On your knees, Crane. Now. So you did it. I must admit I had my doubts that you could make this happen. I'm not asking again. And I'm not talking to you. It is time. Time for what? Jim. I'm sorry. It was the only way. Get me my daughter. Dad! Barbara. Are you all right? Did he hurt you? What are you doing? Call in the transport. We're leaving. Yes, sir. It is time for the people of Gotham to see their savior for who he truly is. A man, just a man, devoid of hope, betrayed by his friends, crippled by fear. Let her go! You both still have a part to play. We had a deal. <laughs> Once I understood your greatest fear, controlling you was simple. You blame yourself for her condition. You need to protect her, but buried deep down is the inevitability that you will one day fail. And that fear makes you mine. Think very carefully about your next move, Commissioner. Her life depends on it. Dad! No! Did you think I wanted him dead? Did you think that would save your daughter? Do you know what happens when a man refuses to be controlled by his fears? He must face them. No! Take me! Please, it's not her you want! Take me!
you don't scare me. Shh. It's okay to be afraid. Killed you. He knew what he was doing. Mayor! Where are they taking you? going to kill him, isn't he? Not while he can use him to get to me. Oh, how chivalrous. Remember the time you carried me like that? I don't, because I was dead. I'll get you set up at the precinct. We'll find your father. Barbara. Scarecrow manipulated me. I what? Where's Tim? Is he okay? I left him at the movie studios. He's fine. Barbara, it's great to see you. Hello, Aaron. It's been a while. Barbara's gonna be helping out here. Whatever you say. She work for you now? Hell, what am I saying? We all do, right? Okay, let's see. First, establish comms with the clock tower computer. They really should upgrade these machines. Okay, we're in. Damn it. Scarecrow's men are already there. They're trying to take out the server room. Copy the data off the mainframe. I can't. The militia are locking down our access. We've lost the connection. We need that data. It's the only way to find my dad. I'll handle it. You can't go there. They'll be expecting you. I'm counting on it. All these years later, and I've still got a soft spot for little Barbara Gordon. Fortunately, mine's not right between the vertebrae.
Cash said it was his anyway. Don't worry, Batman. Barbara's safe here. The clock tower is all yours. You've only lasted this long because it's what he wants. He's been dying all... Go give him hell, Batman. Quick, take it! Sorry, Batman. We didn't touch anything.
I will peel back every layer of the Batman before the night is through. It's safe to reconnect the servers. The control console is on the top floor. Oracle, the clock tower is secure. You're reconnected to the mainframe. Great. Okay, it looks like we lost a couple of servers. It's gonna take a while to restore all my data, but I should be back online by the time you get back here. In the meantime, you might want to head over to the Lady of Gotham. That reporter guy, Jack Ryder, went over there to follow up on a lead. Cash tried to stop him, but Ryder just started shouting about freedom of press. <laughs>